Hi guys, this is the Bombay chef Varun Namdar and today I'm making a simple Italian pudding called panna cotta. Let's begin. Panna cotta is sweet and cream which is thickened and set with the use of gelatin. For that I'm taking some gelatin and hydrating that with some water. Give it a light stir and just allow this to bloom for 3 to 4 minutes. In the interim, let's heat the cream on moderate flame. I'm going to flavor this cream with a little bit of vanilla for which I'm using fresh vanilla pods. For this I'm going to run the blade of this knife right through the center and with the back of this knife just scrape all the beans like so. The vanilla seeds straight go in this bubbling cream and along with this I'm also adding in the scraped vanilla bean. Stir this mixture well, let it boil for 2 to 3 minutes. and make sure it gets nicely infused with the flavor of vanilla beans now that this mixture started boiling i'm going to lower the flame and add in the sugar a gentle mix and once the sugar is dissolved i'll be adding in the bloomed gelatin just make sure the gelatin is nicely dissolved and off goes the flame And now this mixture has to come down to room temperature before you transfer this into any glass mold or any bowl. This panna cotta mixture has been sitting here for 15 to 20 minutes and it's now come down to room temperature. I'm going to discard this vanilla pod and give this mixture another quick mix. I'm going to transfer this in a pourer which is much more comfortable to pour in the containers. carefully pour this in the container or mold of your choice in this case i'm using a glass this goes in the refrigerator for an hour to chill and set the panna cotta has chilled and set perfectly well Now let's garnish this with some fruits. For this, let's cut a kiwi. For a kiwi, it's always important to remove the tooth of the kiwi, which is extremely sharp. This is the tooth of the kiwi. Remove the skin of the kiwi. Next, a few pearls of pomegranate. And finally, some mint leaves. Here's your quick, simple and delectable Italian panna cotta recipe which is done and ready. Do indulge yourself and I'll see you soon next time with another brilliant recipe. See you soon.